Wesley on the beach house. Is it still outside on this window? Yeah. He can't go because of this. It's guarding the house. That's right. So this interdimensional field generator is protecting our house from the time pirate. It seems like he can't get through some type of invisible barrier. I don't think the interdimensional field generator is to, powerful as it used to be. He's trying to find it. It seems like he's able to get closer and closer slowly. Wait a minute. Oh, this doesn't make any sense. What? Are you okay? Oh! Why are we in bed? This That's really weird. This. We were just barely in the bathroom and the time pirate grabbed us. Yeah. Why oh. are we in bed now? This doesn't make any sense. Did we skip time or something? Last I remember, we were in the bathroom and the time pirate the, the interdimensional field generator broke and the time pirate got into our house and grabbed us in the bathroom and then I woke up in bed. That's really weird. I wonder if the kids are okay. Let's go check on the kids. Okay. That's so strange. I, I kind of feel like I have a little bit of a headache. How do you feel? Are you feeling okay? I have a slight headache too. So you're all right? There's Corbin, Charlie. You guys okay? Are you alright? Yeah. Like, yeah, we're outside all the time. Okay, so these guys, you guys are okay, right? Do you have a headache? When did you wake up? It was like a half hour. What was the last thing you remember before falling asleep? I don't know. I don't remember anything. I just woke up. Just woke up? I just woke up. I woke up. You guys don't remember the time pirate? No, I don't remember that. You don't remember the time pirates grabbing us or anything? You remember it though. I do. I do too. This is so weird. Okay, I wonder if what if the Thai pirates are still here? What if they're still around our house? Uh, wait, wait, no. Not Bye. Do you see anything? Are no. they here still? I don't even see any footsteps. They're not doing <gasps> Becca! What? The interdimensional foot oh, generator is gone! It's gone! It did was you, there. Did you move it? I didn't touch did it. Did anybody else? No, we got grabbed by the time pirate and... That's right, and it was here. It was right here. Right before that. I it's gone. It, there, it has a hook. Yeah. So we know that it was there. It was. And that doesn't make any sense. I, I'm Wait. not seeing the hoverboard either. Where is the hoverboard? I don't know. Well, where do we, where do we normally there. keep it? I was keeping the hoverboard. The two, the two hoverboards were by my desk. Um, and my jacket's gone too. And the power of the fourth dimension's gone. It's all gone. Oh no. But just his hat is here. Just his hat. This doesn't make any sense. It was Wait, all here. Do you think maybe we time traveled? Maybe. To... Like... But wait. wait. But it's wait, still wait. almost Christmas. That's right, and the hook is still there. That doesn't make any sense. We didn't have a hook there before. This is really bizarre. Well, you're not seeing, I don't, I'm not seeing the time pirate anywhere outside. So, they're not here now. Well, maybe what we ought to do, maybe, okay, what? I have an idea. What? Let's take J 
James, Corbin, and Ellie with us and go look around. Okay. Let's leave Charlie here with Grandma. Okay. And then let's um, if Grandma's let's go look outside here. and see if there's anything else strange. If okay. Grandma's Maybe we can here. even go for a drive and see if there's anything else strange. We're not protected by the interdimensional fill generator anymore, I know. so we should just. So there's no so there's sense no in staying here. So there's no reason to stay here and just be here the whole time. Okay. All right. Well then, let's get everybody ready and let's go. All right. We have been driving for just a few minutes now. We're starting to just drive around and kind of look around. But you know what we're noticing? There are white trucks and cars everywhere. Almost no other vehicles besides just white trucks and cars. They're everywhere. Because there's white vehicles everywhere, it's almost like the whole city has become overrun with bandits. It's so weird. Zoom in with this. Look at that. Look, here comes another white truck. Straight ahead right there, do you see it? Yeah. They're everywhere. It's a good thing we're in, the, in our white van because we're blending in with all these other white vehicles. I feel really uncomfortable. If these are all bandit vehicles and we're the only one not driving a bandit vehicle, I'd feel really uncomfortable. They target us so fast. Yeah. But if these are all bandits, it's a good thing we're also in a white vehicle. Yeah. Look, there's a white truck. Look at all those white. White truck, white car, white SUV, another white SUV. They're everywhere. Oh, look, another white car and another white truck. Oh my goodness. You see all those? And there's a white truck over there in the backyard and another, Becca, one, look. another one. Oh, you can see the white car right behind us. They're everywhere. More coming. All these another white, white SUV, vehicles. Another white SUV and a white truck. White. And they're not only white because they're covered in snow, they're actually white. There's a white truck that was covered with white. Even the mailman's got a white tr vehicle. Even all the signs are white. They're all white. The so, what do you this think? This is so crazy. Why do you oh, think why do you think there are white vehicles everywhere. everywhere? Do you think they're all bandits? I mean, I've never seen this before in my life. There was a time on so our trip. Crazy. Do you remember on our trip when there were white trucks and white vans everywhere around yes. us this summer when we were on the mystery trip? Yes. This kind of reminds me of like that, except it's like even more extreme. Okay. They're all white vehicles. Yeah. Do you think they're all bandits? <sighs> oh goodness. Look at that billboard! It's an ad for bandits! No Do you see way. that? Do you see that? Just keep your identity a secret. Get a new bandana. Whoa! Oh, what kind of a place are we in? Where are we? What happened? Becca, if bandits have taken over, we need to get some gear. We need to get in like disguises. Okay, I have an idea. Let's there's sit in the parking lot for a little while of this store and let's just see what kind of people come out and take a look. Cause I I want to blend in. This place is not our home. Like this is not the normal place. Oh, <laughs> holy cow, look at this. I'm between two white trucks right now. Yes. Look at that, that. That white vehicle has driven past us a couple times already, just since we've been parked. Yeah. Here. Wonder if I wonder if they recognize us or something. I hope not. Well, we look way different. Look at these people that are getting out of their cars. Guys, they look so guys, guys, look, look, What? What? Oh my gosh! <gasps> Seriously, look! Right there, yeah, look! Look at them! Look, look! Those they do look like bandits. They're dressed like bandits. They're coming to the store. Okay, everybody duck down. Everybody duck. They don't look like they're looking for anything. They're just kind of coming. They're wondering. just going to the store. Becca, this is really good actually, because if you look right over here, this parking lot, there's a store. Okay. And it says, bandits are us. <gasps> Did you even notice <gasps> that? It does. Oh my goodness. I think, 
What is happening? Guys, I think that like our worst nightmares come true. What if the bandits took the necklace and infested everyone? Because all of our treasures are gone. What if somehow... They took the necklace and cha they changed me into a bandit. Right, what if they turned everyone in the whole city into bandits? And now there's bandit stores that and bandit would make billboards sense. and everyone's dr driving bandit vehicles. Okay, and but like this bandits. is not like our normal reality. <gasps> what if this is like an alternate reality? What if this isn't like our dimension? What if everything has changed but it's because we're in the same place but not really? If that's a bandit store, what if they sell bandit clothes? Maybe we should sneak in well, there. Well, if it's bandits are us, they probably do. Let's just sneak in, yeah. like you said. Yeah. And let's get something that we can be in disguise with. Perfect. Let's do it, because we got to blend in or we're going to get in big trouble here. Yeah. Okay, let's go. I do not want the bandits to catch us again. Found some paper, some ads or something, so I'm going to use this as a disguise. Okay, everybody put them up to your face and kind of walk towards the store that way. Hold it like this. <laughs> We just yeah, snuck in boobs. and check it out. This is definitely a bandit supply store because there are boots everywhere. Look, all the aisles are filled with boots or there's some cowboy hats up here too. I think this is definitely gonna be the right place. Guys, we need to get some cowboy boots and some hats and bandanas as fast as we can so we yeah. can blend in okay. because I don't want any of the people working here to see us or any of the other people to see us not dressed like bandits. Yeah. We're gonna be in big trouble. So pick out some that, that will fit for everybody. Guys, check out these hats. These bandanas, they're everywhere. Look at that. Oh wow, we hit the jackpot. They're like every every kind of bandana you can imagine. Well let's get some hats and bandanas for everybody. Okay. Everyone, literally everyone in the store is dressed like this. We need to get. We've got to get some clothes to match. Okay. Okay, I got some boots for me. They fit really well. And check out this hat, you guys. Now all I need is a bandana. I'm gonna blend right in. Oh. 